Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this quick video, I'm going to briefly talk about the methyl group and provide an example as well. Let's get started. So the methyl group is one central carbon atom bonded to three hydrogen atoms. It has an R group as well, and that R group can be anything. It can be an element or a complete molecule. That's not really important for this video, but what is important are these bonds right here. These, as you might see, are carbon-hydrogen bonds, which means they're nonpolar. Because of this, the methyl group does not ionize at cellular pH, which is about 7.4. Let's take a look at this example. This molecule is called methanol, and it basically combines a methyl group and a hydroxyl group to form an alcohol. As you can see here, the hydroxyl is the R group to the methyl group in this case. Now, something that you might have already known is that the methyl group is closely related to methane, which has the molecular formula CH4. Now, this is not to say that methane is an example of a compound that contains a methyl group, because it's actually quite the opposite. Methyl is a functional group derived from methane, so it actually contributes to the formation of methyl, and it happens when methane loses a hydrogen atom. So take away the four and put a three there because you lost a hydrogen. So that's a quick intro to the methyl group. Let me know if you want to see any more videos about it or if you have specific functional groups that you would like to see. Leave your questions in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching.